All right, we have the ID of Abdullah James. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Yes, Abdullah. How are you? Hello. I'm I'm good. Yeah. All right. You are live on air, my friend, and people this hear you in YouTube. What do you want to say to us about the topic? Um. Um. I can hear. I can hear a double voice because I'm speaking on my computer. No. And, uh, mute, and mute YouTube. Mute YouTube, so you will not have that. Either exit YouTube or mute YouTube. Okay, I'll just speak here. Okay. So, uh, what okay. do you want to say to us about the topic we are talking about? Um, I just want to um go over basically what you're talking about. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Like if um anybody wants anything to talk about, then we can go over it. No problem. Go. I will let you speak as you wish. Whatever you want. What? Go ahead. Um, do you want to pick a topic or anything? I don't know. No, we are talking already. You are talking about Allah. He have hands. Allah have shape. We have mistakes in the Quran. Why Allah have a foot? Um. Well, <laughs> I think um, with that isn't actually correct. That um. We believe that Allah, we don't actually know what he looks like. Hmm. We haven't um, been told what his um, physical image is. Hmm. An example is um, when the Prophet Musa, alayhi hmm. salam, um, basically um, he used to speak with Allah. Hmm. And um, he was very curious, like, you know, um, humans, like naturally we, we get curious, like we want to know more. Hmm. So he asked Allah, um, can I can I see you? Like, can I see what you look like? Mm. Because um, basically, like I've I've been wondering. Mm. I don't know. I've been like very curious. <clears throat> so Allah, He told him, um, "There's a mountain over there. Um, look at the mountain, and you'll be able to see me." Okay. Um, so he looked at the mountain, mm. but then he collapsed, and the mountain um, crumbled mm. because basically Allah's image cannot be contained in his creation hmm. so from this you can see that we don't actually know what he looks like also when the prophet went on um went to um um get the the prayer okay so he okay. was you informed know, about the prayer story let me ask you there is a there is okay. a verse in the bible in the book of genesis okay speaking about god created adam in his image Okay. Can you see the screen? It says this is Genesis chapter five. Um, we are reading from verse screen, number no, one. Oh, no, no problem. It says here it says that God created man in the likeness of God, made him, which means in the image of God. Yeah. Okay. Do you agree with that or do you refuse that? Um, is this quoting from the Bible? This is from the Bible, yes. Um, I'm I don't I'm not sure. No, so this is, Bible, this is from um, the okay. Quran to make it simple the, for you. Bible, to, to make it okay. okay, to make it simple, God he says that the, the Bible says that God created Adam in his image, which is the image of God as a Christ. Do you agree with that? As God, sorry, can you repeat the question? Sorry. Do you agree that Adam have the likeness as image of God? Um, I don't have enough knowledge to answer that question. Sorry. So your God Allah is not in the. He does not look like uh, Adam. No, he, um, they they do not have the similar Im um, image. No, they do not. So what if Allah looked like Adam? If we discovered that Allah he looked like Adam, what we would do? Is that would be a problem because he looked like a man? What? If Allah looked like Adam, is that will be a problem for you because he looked like a man? But um, Allah has told us that um, he is not in our. He is not. He is not like us. Mm. So he's he, basically Allah has told us that he is beyond our imagination. Okay, so, so why? So why you don't confirm? Why you don't, okay, sorry, my, my friend. If he is beyond our imagination. Then okay. how can Allah be the same as Adam with hands and feet and stuff like that? All right. That so, doesn't make so sense. So my friend, as long you confirm to me 
you can confirm to me that Allah is not like our image why you cannot confirm to me that there is no way Allah will be in the image of Adam no he will be or he will be not he won't know okay so we confirm now that this will be false okay okay do you confirm that that any teaching like this like is in the Bible that God created Adam in his image do you agree According um, to Islam. In the Bible, I've, I've heard that it's in the Bible, but um, yeah, yeah. I just I'm, I'm showing you the Bible right now. It's Genesis chapter 5, verse number well, we're reading from verse number one to three, etc. It's oh, yeah, I can see now. Sorry, sorry, yeah, all right. God created the man in his image, okay, yeah, okay. Now, is that something Islam agree upon, or this is false according to Islam? God isn't exactly like God. It, God isn't. I, I want exactly. an answer, my friend. Is that according to Islam accurate or this is false? No. Yes, yeah, it's false. It's false. Okay. So why are your prophet saying this? Saying what? Saying the same. Saying that God created Adam in his image. Hmm? Allah created Adam in his image. It's hard and your screen is moving. Going with the group of angels sitting there and listen what they were saying to you for. That's picture, not Image like is the physical. same. Picture you didn't is say the same. anything about my friend. This is you translation. Didn't say anything about my, physical features. My friend, no, this is physical picture. Even he described for you how tall he is. He says to you he is 60 cubit. So don't tell me in a picture. This is in Arabic. It says Surah. Surah. So what Allah? So what al khalq Surah is the way He created you physically. So here, okay. Allah created Adam in His picture, in His image, sixty cubit. Okay. This is exactly what the Bible says, except the addition, which is saying He is uh, sixty cubit tall. So what we will say now? You just say, remember, that whoever believed that this must be false. Well, it depends on like it didn't you do, when you're reading a text mm. yeah you don't read it sometimes you don't read it literal like um no it's literal have, because he um, described for you he described for you okay my, my friend i'm not speaking okay when i have um a few friends that i speak to that are also friend, christian as well hold on and when you we say to you about, we what, debate about the bible and stuff in it no problem when he and said to you 60 they, cubit is that literal or not when he said to you 60 cubit tall is that literal or not So I can you say that again? Sorry, I can't hear clearly. When somebody says to you, I created something, building, and it is 30 meter tall, is that literate or this is metaphorical? Uh, I'm not sure. What do you mean, sure? He told you how tall it is. Tall is okay. about size. That's literal. When he's talking about the building, yes. It's okay, literal. so literal, here we go. He says that Allah, he created Adam and he was 60 cubit tall. Okay. Okay. So how this is can be metaphorical? This part is not, but the before the comma. My friend, it's not, my friend, so, there is no comma. What comma? What comma? He says Allah you created are, you Adam. Are in translation. Allah created Adam in His image. This is why you are a prophet. He said, "Don't beat your brother in his face." Why? Why? Read carefully. I'm trying, I'm... When any one of you fights with his brother, he should oh. avoid his face. For Allah created Adam in His own image. Do you see it? In his, he should avoid his face. Mm -hmm. Allah created Adam in His own image. Okay. Hmm. So why mm -hmm. you should ab avoid beating your brother in his face? What is the reason? You can beat him in his ass, but not in his face. Why? So my brain is is I can't think straight right now. Well, you you were very excited in the text. You were a hero in the text, man, calling me a liar, la 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 la, la. And now you have nothing to say. I mean, I, so I apologize about that part. Um, no problem. You see, I, 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 I you can call me name. I no miss, problem. I you misheard see, what you said. I friend, you said um, I'm here to help the Muslims. I'm not angry yeah. from you. You can call me names as you wish. No problem. I'm asking you now. So I'm I'm, you know I'm what? Pilot. You know I'm you know what, my friend? I'm going to change the topic for you, just for you. Okay. I want you to give me 
you tell me what do you want to talk about to prove to me that Allah is God how you can do that don't talk about okay. anything, anything negative I don't want to ask you about something negative uh, I don't want to like uh, okay here there's a mistake or there's a no 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 I want you to give me something really strong will make all those people we have almost a thousand people listening they will be shocked about how the proof how strong the proof you gave us about Allah he must be God what you will do well, I'm not a person of knowledge, so I still can't say a lot. So, what, um, uh, my friend, uh, 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 you are a Muslim or you are a Hindu? I'm a Muslim. Okay. So, how a Muslim do not know why he's a Muslim? Why you are a Muslim? Because I believe that Allah is God. Okay, what make you believe he is God? Because of the miracles. Okay, here we go. Yeah, here we go. We are getting closer. Give us one. Give us a miracle which will make the people go crazy. Okay, um, for example, in the Quran, mm. there's um, scientific uh, miracles, there's mathematical miracles, there's linguistic like what? Like miracles. What? Like what? Give us one. Choose okay. one you like, the best of them. Okay, mathematical miracles in the Quran. Like what? Um, one moment. Mm. Give me one moment. Mm. Sorry. Uh... <sighs> So, um, so in the Quran, mm -hmm. the I'm talking about like linguistic and mathemat no mathematical miracles in the Quran. Do you speak Arabic first to speak about linguist? Um, no, I'm talking about like literally, like if you translate it into any other languages. Okay, no problem. Okay, give me, go, okay go, go ahead. I'm listening. So, um, the number of times the word man is mentioned in the Quran and the number of times women is mentioned in the Quran is 24. Okay, let's see if this is true or not. Life on air. Is that okay with you? Okay. Okay, what is the word man in Arabic? Uh, I am not sure. Um, okay, I'm are, you searching, are you searching in Google? You're searching in Google, right? Okay. The article? Okay. The name of man in Arabic. Okay, hold on, hold on. Numbers of man, because I want to show the people on the screen. Word okay. In Quran, I will search in Google. Maybe I can find the same article you are reading from. Mm -hmm. okay. It's. Um, you want me to send the link in the MQ? Uh, no, I don't open links from uh, Skype. Sorry. Uh, let us see. Is that Islam dot Islam No, it's um. Okay. Um, debatewise.org. Okay, hold on. Man. All right. Where is it? But you see, I'm trying to find if they wrote that word in Arabic so we can search for the exactly the same word. I found actually an article, but it doesn't say the Arabic words. Th does the one you have have the Arabic words for the words or only in English? <coughs> it's English. Only English. It's, it's, it's website it's it's it hasn't got I know, but does it does it uh put the word arabic next to the word man okay anyway uh, I, will, I will okay i will go right now in front of you in the screen look with me in the screen the word man in arabic is it's, rajul it's kind of frozen i don't know okay let me refresh the page sorry one moment yeah the word the word man in arabic is rajul rajul okay all right how many time it appear Thirteen time. I think this. What this means is that you know, like when you have synonyms and. Um, no, no, my friend. This is this is a total number. This is the total. This is not like a. I know, I know, I know. I know but when you're talking in, um, with, um, I'm not talking about like the literal. I'm not talking about. Um, the word no, man no. Itself, they I'm are talking about, about that because when you say the total number no no when you say the to no 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 when you say the total number it's mean total number of whatever the word is exist so whatever the word man is exist do you want us to switch to english shall we switch to english he wants english we can search for the word man in english and then you will see that they are lying to you which translation you wish pick up one what do you mean by translate because we can search for the word man in English. 
in Arabic it doesn't show what they are saying the same for the word men women Nisa yes the word Nisa is women it appears 71 times Nisa hmm. so what we will do now it's a lie give me another lie okay let me go back to what I was saying before when I'm talking about the word man I'm not talking when because in in my, literature, my, friend, my friend my friend either you give when, me the word even you give sure. either you give me the word okay my friend when either you give me the word as it is in Arabic or this is a game we anybody can play it says okay I'm, I'm as you see now I'm not searching for exact word which mean any word is a man will appear in Arabic anyone I don't see them can you repeat word, that again sorry I didn't, I didn't hear you, when we say okay when we say the word man it's mean the word man yeah okay, okay. the word man is Roger in Arabic that's it Rajul, you can search anyone this is the only what 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 what, what is the other word other four <laughs> huh okay let me just um this time okay so um <coughs> Okay, the word um the word dunya for life dunya okay so here we go okay thank you you gave us the word dunya okay how many times the word dunya appear 115 times okay 100 and what 15 115 that's wonderful it's 128 we can change the website for you give me a second maybe we can uh, search for uh, maybe a website will help you better because this search engine sometime let us go to search.com search truth Islamic website because that website have like you can choose in the in the search okay I want you to look with me in this in the screen I will open the screen for you and I will choose all the options all right read with me carefully my friend do you see a screen no okay the Just word dunya the word dunya i search for the word dunya here it says all words do you see it all words you see um, it? no it's, it's not the same yeah. okay take your time okay it's just gonna come okay it's there now all words appear 111 times how many times you said this should appear uh, 115 okay here it says 111 i will make it any word So in different Nothing websites, hold on, hold on. If we change exact phrase, if we say exact phrase, look how many. I will search. Not even found. Not why, even why once. Is not found? Because the word in the Quran appear as al dunya, and now we will find it as one hundred seven time. So they did lie to us again. There's different ways of saying good luck. How you said there's what you can say al dunya, you can say dunya. It doesn't matter. We search for dunya. We search for my friend. We search for dunya and we search for ad dunya. We search for any word. We search for all the words. If you speak a different language, they know that there isn't just my one friend, word. This is Quraysh something. language. This is not different language. This is Arabic Quraysh. And I, this is this is my first language. I'm not an Italian person speaking to you. We search for the word. As it is, and we search for any words. Still, we did not get the numbers. What are the other words you said? Say again. What is the other word you ask for? Um, let me go back to the website. Oh, I lost it. <laughs> All those numbers are fabricated. Not a single one of them is it true? Even mathematical miracles, the scientific miracles. Okay, forget. Okay. okay, so guys, the mathematical miracle did not work. Okay, go to the scientific miracle. Go ahead. 
Give us a scientific miracle. Like what? Work we got scientific miracles. Oh, search Prophet Google. I'm gonna because I'm take your not, time, no, no problem. Okay. Um, okay, this is the um Trying to find a verse. Just tell me what the miracle. I will find you the verse. What is the miracle about what? Okay. Um. Okay. This is one verse. I'm um, talking about um terminal velocity. What is that? What is that? I don't um, understand what that in Arab in Arab in English. What does that mean? Um, so basically, you know, when you're falling down from the sky. All right. And um, you're falling down, and then there's a maximum speed that you can fall at. Okay. But it's talking about that. Where where it's talking about that? I want to see how okay, this. Um, but sort of no, I, I, verse. I know, I know, I know where, what where it says. But where it says that in that verse, how they come to this conclusion? How how they lie to you? What? Do, okay, read for us. I, read read for us the verse. Uh, read for us the verse. So um, it's saying. Being true to Allah mm. with without associating anything with Him, mm. whoever associates anything with Allah is mm. as though he has fallen from the sky and was snatched by the birds. Mm. Was so now, snatched, by, by, the snatched by the bird is a is a miracle. Well, we're we talking about okay. Yeah, yeah, we're talking about what? How this is can be a scientific miracle? This is something we see, and oh, oh, everybody knows. There's birds. Like especially like the eagle or etc. When they see uh, uh, any bird flying, they snatch him, and that's all. Say that again. When an eagle he see a sparrow or a little bird in the sky, he snatch him, he kidnap him, he take him. Okay, what does have to do with the miracle you are talking about, or the science you are talking about? This is something we see every day. This is a discovery okay, now. So basically, huh? It's saying, okay, look, 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 listen, okay, listen to me, what I'm saying. It's saying, okay. being true to Allah mm. without associating anything with Him, mm. whoever associates anything with Allah is as though He has fallen from the sky and was snatched by the birds. So, sure. basically, it's saying, mm. because um, if you're falling from the sky, mm. so for example, you're falling from the sky in it, and then there's a bird, mm. and then it, it catches you. Mm. It snatches you mm. like it's actually it's not really possible for something to fall faster than something no okay you have two objects okay they're falling down one's above the other mm. and the falling faster mm. than something the falling faster mm. then you can fall it's not possible for the person behind you mm. To fall faster than the person is in front of my you, friend, the is, my friend, you are assuming that the bird is falling like you, is falling from the same point, and you are now like okay, he was there down before me, and now going after him, it is something falling down, and the bird is there. He jump in the right moment, he snap him. What? Where is the miracle? So you Muslims are desperate trying to find it's anything. It's not. A, it's it's my it's friend, not a miracle. Have you ever it. heard? Have it's, you ever saw? It's not a miracle have you ever uh, have it's you called, ever saw? Have you ever hold on, hold on, hold on. Have you ever saw an eagle flying with a bird or a fish he could nap? And then the fish fell down. Another bird he fly and he grabbed that bird that thing in the air. Why it's impossible? I'm, not, I'm talking about falling down. Falling down, not, no problem. He's I'm falling down. down. Uh, first bird, he took the thing up. And when have he you was flying, have you ever gone skydiving? <laughs> My friend, yes, I did skydiving. In the, sky yes, I did skydiving. Yes, I did. Yes, I skydiving. did. Secondly, the bird here can he snatch a man? Okay. Can have he you snatch ever, a man? Have, can can have, a have bird? You ever He's talking about what? Talking about a human being falling down from the sky. How oh. in the world a bird can snatch? A weight of a man. If a human being fell in the airplane, will destroy it because his weight will be like a missile. 
So it's so impossible to snatch. Just like we don't take the Bible, just like when when you read the Bible, you don't take it literally. See, word no, by you word. are taking it literally. You, you see, you see the hypocrisy. A second ago, you were taking it literally, saying this is about when you fell down and somebody and you asked me, did you do skydiving? So it was literally. Now you don't want it literally no more. When you said no, to me, asking, when you said to me, did you sky? So okay, hold on. So is this is literally or not literally? I'm just asking you a general question. I'm asking, asking you now. Answer. Is it literally or not? But can you answer the question? I is answer, that literally or I not? I want an answer. Is this is literally the example you gave me? Is that scientifically accurate, literally, or this is was metaphorical and you try to make it scientific? Because when you say it's a, it's a metaphorical verse. Okay. You can take literal or metaphorically. But okay, which one? You, which side? Si which it. side you are taking? Which side you are taking? You are taking now the miracle, the literally or the metaphorically? I'm trying to just. Okay, I'm trying to. Okay, so basically, okay, okay. <laughs> the bird was snapped. The guy was snatched by the birds. Okay. Who is so, like? Who, which um, which bird can snatch a guy? I mean, how a bird, in order to snatch something, have to be a lot lighter than you. A lot seen lighter, it? a lot lighter. So how a bird can snatch a human being, especially he's falling down. He can I snatch see. him. He can't I even. See. He cannot no, even he snatch him. him. Listen, he cannot even snatch him when he is in the ground, especially if it's a man. What about snatching a man falling down? It's There's impossible. Between snatch and pick up, brother. Huh? There's a difference between snatch and pick up. What pick up? It says Snatch means okay. When somebody's when somebody's falling and you snatch it okay what does that mean say that he never said that they picked him up did it did you no, say that that's what him i'm up? saying that's what i'm saying picked up is a lot easier because you don't have extra power to your weight now it's only your weight but when you are feeling down you have extreme power coming down with you because your weight the more you go down the more with this speed will increase and the more you will be heavy because now you have the 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 the, the, the gravity taking you down it's not you standing in the ground. So if a bird wanna grab one kilograms from the ground, it is different from grabbing or snatching one kilogram failing down from high sky. That will kill him. He cannot snatch it. It's impossible. So you are talking about a human being. You are talking about what? We're talking about a human being who don't believe in Allah. As if he's failing down from the sky and the bird will snatch him. How the bird can do that? Okay, okay, okay. Let's change. Let's change. Let's ch let's change. Okay. All right. Another area in the Quran it says that the mountains are pegs. The mountains are what? Pegs. Okay. Thank you very much pegs. for this miracle. No, what about it? Tell me. Okay. So basically, um, the pegs are something that holds something in it. Mm hmm. Okay. So basically, in Quran, it's basically describing pegs mm -hmm. as part of the ground. As mm. part of the ground, the mountains as part of the ground. Mm. So it's basically saying that the mountains are actually part of the ground. It, it, it that's what pegs mean. The pegs mean as a nail, so it's not no, part of it, the ground. When it, when, no, no, no. When it, what what the word what the what, the, what this word mean? P e g s. What this word mean? Do you know when you hold clothes? Or? My friend, what does this word mean in English? What this you word know, mean? You know when you have washing your clothes. No, and my friend. No, not not washing your clothes. No, when you you know this is about something you use for the tent. When you have a tent, you put nails in the ground to hold the rope of your tent. Is that correct? Yes. Okay. So is the mountains being pushed inside the earth, or the mountains are coming from the earth? Both. No, that's false. It's coming from the earth. It is not something we put in the top of the earth. It depends on what type of mountain you're talking it about. It doesn't matter. All mountains are coming from the ground. What are you saying to me? There's mountains. We throw them, put them in the top of the earth somewhere. Okay. What? Okay. 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 Let me show you something. Okay. Show if me I something. can send a link in the um in in the group in the chat. Okay. It's a picture. Okay. You can post it in the post it in the chat. You can post it in the chat. Remember, you are the one who said to me that mountains are not part of the earth. You said that, right? 
are they okay, I'm gonna say are I'm they part country. of the earth or they are not part of the earth one moment no no confirm to me are I've they part said, of the earth or they are not part of the earth i've sent that i've sent the picture i okay no problem i'm asking you are they part of the earth or not no they, well it depends because they're across it's across the what earth's across? crust what the mountains are not like part part of the earth it's the crust on top of the earth okay but is it mean they are okay uh, let me make it simple for you did allah Basically, place okay. the roots, my friend the hold, on, hold, on, hold, on, hold on hold on hold on hold on yes did allah place the mountains in the top of the earth or the mountains came from inside the earth they came from inside the earth so like, any, the, 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 Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, one, 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 one. hold on. So the mountains, guys, he just said, the mountains no. come from inside the earth. I want you to confirm that, so later we will not change our mind. It depends on where you're coming from. Don't tell me the band, you can don't, don't tell me the band, the either earth. here or there. No, it cannot be both, one of them. One of them, don't tell me the band, there's no band. Either it is from inside the earth or from out, or it is placed in the top of the earth. Which one? Choose one. Okay, so what? Okay, what? Is it, is it the place? The Come on, let me go back to I'm not the talking now. Saying. I'm asking you according to science, please. Then, then we will talk about the verse. According to science, the one you know, is the mountains placed in the top of the earth or the mountains are coming from inside the earth? I want an answer from you. Please. What we will do now? Why, why you don't want to answer? You are searching Google. Saying something, so saying that something is from and put like that. That they, 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 you never saw the mountains coming flying from the sky, did you? So obviously <laughs> they came from the earth. My friend, okay, I'm asking you. Don't give me an answer. So according to you, according to the science you understand and you believe in, is the mountains coming from the sky? Placed on the earth, or they are coming from inside the earth. They don't come from inside the earth, they come from the earth. Okay, they come from inside the earth. That's wonderful, guys. Finally, he said something, and now we can go. Let me show you the different okay. verse. Okay, hold on. We go to different verse on the Quran. And remember, you just said that you cannot take it back because now you will say, Ah, oh, I did not say that. Oh, no way, you did, and everybody heard you. It's recorded. If we go in the Quran, okay, it says the following. Let us see. <clears throat> okay. Go to forty. Uh, Chapter 79, verse number 32. Okay, what is this? I don't understand. I don't know. Okay. Chapter 79, verse number 32. What it says? Wait, which one? Sorry. Chapter 79, verse number 32. What it does say? 32. That's, um, that's, we can't see 32. Hmm. Do you know what it says? The, um, the screens, I can't see anything on the screen. No, I'm asking you. Do you know what it says? I'm not. Hmm. According to your God, Allah, he placed the mountains in the top of the earth. Okay. Is that correct? Yes. Okay, but you said to me the earth is where the mountains coming from he did not place it on top of them but the mountains are placed on the earth like the, the on the earth like no the you said the, nobody heard you and i asked you twice and i asked you twice and i i asked you i asked you twice and you confirmed that the mountains is coming from inside the earth not placed on the top of the earth yes. okay the so so when the, the when the quran says yeah. allah he placed the mountains in the top of the earth that means it's wrong Okay, can you show me the um the first please? Here we go. 
read this verse chapter 41 verse number 10 We can change the translation if you don't like this translation. Which translation you is your favorite? This is okay. Hmm. I asked you, is the mountains in the top of the earth or they are from the earth? You answered and everybody heard you. You said from inside the earth, not from the top of the earth. According okay. to your God, he placed the mountain in the top of the earth. Where do you say on top of the earth? He says, says he placed with there in. Yes, the and earth. then he placed, it says, read, read carefully, he placed, read carefully, there, he placed therein, he placed, what he placed mean? He placed therein. Okay, he, what, what, what does that mean? He placed, when you say I placed, when I say I placed something, I placed this here, what does that mean? He placed, the, when you have, when you say he placed, that means you put something on top. But then when you add the word there okay. in, when you say he placed, no, he, no, 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 no. Well, there's no in. First of all, there is no in. Secondly, it yeah. says he placed there in firm mountains. He placed it there. It's not from the earth. It was no mountains, and he placed it there. What's mean that there was a mountain? He took it. He placed it on the earth. Okay. Okay, but this is wrong according to you. You are the one who said to me that that verse saying, according to you, that it's coming from inside the earth. You try to explain it this way, but it's not. The Quran confirmed that Allah, he placed the mountains in the top of the earth. One moment, please. Okay. So this is a problem. How Allah he says such a silly stuff. How does God he think that he placed mountains in the top of the earth, and this is how the mountains are formed? There was earth, okay? He made it flat, and then he placed the mountains in the top of it. Okay. So what we will do now? Okay, so basically, basically, this is a uh, absolutely false. When he says place therein for mountains from mm. above it, he yeah. says the word above it in it. So that means it's on top. Okay. My friend, it, 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 w w come on. Okay. Everybody, everybody okay. Uh, you know, I don't want to, I don't want to like uh, uh, say something will offend you. I'm we trying to be, I'm trying to be, I'm trying to be friendly Stop. with you. Be yes. honest. Be honest with me. When you say I placed something on something, okay. Placed okay. the thing that's mean that thing was not there, correct? Okay, yes. Okay, and where I place it? You continue the verse for me. Where you where you place it? He placed it in the earth. Firm where, mountains. where okay, he placed it. You said you said in the earth, correct? He, he placed it in the earth. Okay, you said that. Okay, that's mean the earth that, that's mean the mountains. That's mean the mountains are not from the earth. That's mean the mountains. Are not from the earth. Do we agree? Where does he say they're not from the earth? Because he placed it on the earth. The earth was there, and then he yeah. placed it on the earth. I mean, come on. <laughs> Where does he say he then placed therein? Because my, the earth. My friend, he described for you how he created the earth, and he is speaking about things in order. Read carefully with me. Say, okay. O Muhammad, do you verily disbelieve in him who created the earth in two days? Okay. What he did, he created the earth in two days. Okay. And then in Arabic, here it says, وَجَعَلَ فِيهَا رَوَاسِي Wa okay. is a harfu atf, which means next. He did this. And wa, he did this. And wa, he did this. This is what and mean. So, and then if we change the translation, maybe the translation here is making you confused. We can change the translation for you because this is what it says. Let us go to Yusuf Ali. Do you like Yusuf Ali or you like something else? Choose anyone. Any. Okay. All right. This one is even, even, even better. He said on earth, mountains are standing firm. Which one was exist before the earth, correct? 
Show me. When I say, when I say, I sit on the earth. He already he said to us, he created the earth. So earth is already exist. Do we agree? He said on the earth, mountain standing from mm. high above it. Mm. Look, go back. Okay. He sat on the earth, mountain standing from high above it. Mm. And bestowed blessings on the earth. Mm. And I did that. Oh yeah, yeah, you can't read it. What? Um, I, I was reading it. All right. Um, and show the whole verse. We are showing. What do you? What do you want? Which verse? Here, the, the verse before have nothing to do with the topic. It's nine or ten? Nine and ten. We are showing nine and ten. Here we go. This is nine and this is ten. And I will take okay. the the bar so you can see it all of it. Hold on. There we go. <laughs> um, say it that you deny him who created the earth in two days, and mm. do you do you join equal with him? Okay. Mm. So, what we will do now? What do you understand? I, I don't, I don't care what, you, what your point is. What are you trying to say? My, my point is, you confirm to me that the mountains coming from inside the earth, according to the Quran, Allah He placed the mountains in the top of the earth, and this is absolutely false. He sat on the earth, mountain standing firm. Hmm. Okay, let me check something. Um, are you still here? I'm listening to you, waiting for you. Yeah, I'm, I'm here. <laughs> I was wondering what happened then. No, I'm wondering what happened. You are the one who is going to search. I'm, I'm, I'm listening to you. You are searching in, in Google, and I'm waiting for the answer. The verse is so clear. This is what you choose for me, and what you choose for me. You wanted to choose it to prove to me that the Quran is a book of God, but what you choose for me, proving to me that the Quran is a false book. I did not prove. Um... You choose this one. It's not me who choose this one. It is you who choose to show me those verses to show me how the mountains is created. Correct. Wasn't this is your choice? Yes. Okay, but this is wrong. I'm just, I'm just, I'm reading. So Sorry. what we will do? Well, um, what I was trying to say from before, yeah, sorry, is that if you was to see the structure of the earth, mm. I'm not sure if you know how it is, but there's a, a, a liquid layer underneath the solid layer. <laughs> My but friend, I layer, ask you, okay. I ask you to stop playing games. You said from the beginning, I asked you the question twice, you said, the mountains are created from inside the earth. Are you going to swallow what you said back, or you still stand for what yeah, you I said? Agree that. Okay, I, okay, I agree. That. Here I it agree says, that. here it says, Allah He put the mountains on the top of the earth. Which Read one is exactly the correct what one? He says, he says he set on the earth. Don't, don't, don't change change the words. What? Read it as exactly how it says. Okay, He said the mountains. What it means? He said. He set on the earth. What it means? It said. I said. I said. I said on something. What does that mean? This mean I am in the top of that thing, correct? That's that means set. That's yeah, the th word set. Yeah, this is what this word set means. Set you you place something in the top of something. You place something in the top of something, or you sit on it. 
you know what said man right when you say I sit in the chair it's mean I I am not the chair I am in the top of the chair okay okay so he said on the earth mountains so the mountains are placed set on the earth in the above they are not even inside the earth it's from above and this is absolutely scientifically wrong okay did god put trees on the earth what did god put, did god put trees on the earth he did not put the trees in the earth the, the, the he, he placed a seed in the ground and they grow this is not but what but so God listen and we are talking about the mountains the mountains are made of rocks they are not growing and they grow by size by food we are it's talking about funny. how he created the mountains is the mountain the same as a tree? No, I'm just I can't take a tree, I can't take a tree, and I can place it in different place. It's possible. But yes. here we are talking about how the tree, how, how the mountains are created. So according to Islam, the earth was a flat, and Allah He made mountains in the top of it. I don't know how to respond to that. Okay, right. but you are the one who mentioned this to me to prove to me that the Quran have a miracle. Okay, let's go to a different one. Forget about this one. This one is a stupid. It's obviously Allah cannot be God based on this. Give me a different one. Okay. Hmm. <clears throat> Um, the Big Bang in the Quran. The Big Bang, that's wonderful. We're in the Big Bang in the Quran. Okay, um, D, um, is um, Surah 21, verse 30. I know, you do not need to tell me, but I'm saying, where is the Big Bang? Explain to us. Okay, it says, um, do not those who disbelieve see that the heavens and the earth hmm. were meshed together, and then we rip ripped them apart, hmm. and then we made of water everything living, would they still not believe? Okay, and where is the big band there? It didn't say literally the big bang, it says okay. the word, my friend, uh, you are the one who said the big uh, bang is there. All right, uh -huh. so it have to be there. Don't tell me it did not say literally. Now, do you know? So okay, literal. all right, no problem. But when you say the big bang, that's mean literally. You said the big bang is there, so literally, the big bang is a physical thing, it's not a metaphorical. So where it says the Big Bang, my friend. I'm not asking you, by the way, to show me the word Big Bang. No, I'm asking you where in the verse it says that there's a Big Bang happened. Okay, it says here, where the earth were meshed together hmm. and then we ripped them apart. All right, but that's mean there was earth and there was heaven and they are okay. united together, okay. correct? In this translation, it says we joined hold on. together. Hold on, one year hold on. Creation. Here we have a mistake. Here we, we have a mistake, a clear mistake. The Quran says, that the earth and the heaven they used to be one piece and we split them from each other do you agree with that so again okay yes okay so the quran saying that the earth and the heaven they used to be one piece are we really split now from the space or we are inside the space what are you talking about brother it says there that the earth and the heaven used to be one unit to join together so there was okay. earth there was earth and there was heaven the Big Bang, it doesn't say that. The Big Bang says the Earth created millions and trillions of years after that. So when you say Big Bang, how you say that the Earth and the Heaven, they used to be together, and then we split them. And now, are we really split from the space or we are inside the space? Okay, um, do you know what the Big Bang is? I know what the Big Bang. Two, two women, they are fighting together over their son-in-law. But this is not my my topic now listen where is the big bang there the earth was and the heaven they used to be together and allah he split them are we split from the space or we are inside the space i don't understand your logic there are we inside the space let me show you google to, to, to you don't understand you understand come on i mean now you don't understand you are a person who knows what the Big Bang and now you don't understand what I'm talking about. Let me ask you, are we inside the space or we are not? 
We are inside. We are in space. One okay. Earth. So the Quran is wrong. So the Quran is wrong because we are not split from the heaven. We are inside the heaven. Actually, the earth is not even like a little tiny dust inside the heaven. So how we are split from the heaven? Are we? Are, are, is, 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 is the earth is the earth is something is exist by itself and the heaven have nothing to do with it or the earth is inside the heaven okay do you know how the big do you know anything about the big i'm asking you, know you don't change the topic is the earth is inside the sky or we are not inside the sky the sky is part of the earth it's not it is the earth opposite when you say the sky is part of the earth you are saying as if the earth is the big one and the sky is the small one. We are little tiny dust inside the sky. Do you mean spe like the okay. space, the space, the space around us? This is the sky. When you say heaven, the Quran actually even doesn't say even the word heaven. It says as samawat, which means the skies. So in the sky, are we inside the sky or we are totally out of the sky? We're inside the sky. Okay, so we are in the sky. So how the Quran okay. makes such a stupid mistake saying that we are not united with the sky no more and we are separated? It didn't say that. It, said, it says that. You, hold on. Hold on. Okay. You are the one who called for this one for me to show me that he split them and he made them two pieces. One piece is called the earth and one piece is called the sky. I Isn't this is the purpose of this topic? You said to me I the big English, bang. I don't the think big... Your English teachers taught you much English. My friend, you speak English better than me. No problem. I know you, you don't understand the English language. No, probably. you understand. The, first of all, I'm not reading your Quran in, in English. I read it in Arabic, and you are the one who don't understand the language of your God. You pray to Allah in a language which you don't understand, and now you are giving me a speech about English. Uh, now answer, Mister Mister Man, who speak English. Did Allah did Allah separated the earth from the sky? Did He say that in the Quran? You just read it. Okay, I'm asking you. Would, would your English, with your perfect English, did Allah separate the earth from the sky? Either you say yes or you say no. He never. What never? Okay, hold on. Hold, okay, hold on. Okay, hold on. I thought you speak good English. It says here, do not the disbelievers see that the heavens and earth were meshed together? Meshed means mean they were all one. So it, it wasn't like they were squashed together like somebody got the earth and heaven and squished them I all don't together. care. They used to be one unit. Yes or no? Yes. Okay. And the, now what happened? And now what happened? Are we not one unit no more? Say that again? Are, are we not inside the space? Because if you say we, we are not no more, it means we are not in the space. We're going around in circles. This is not the question. Who cares about going circle? You, are you in the unit or what? Are we inside the earth, the, the, the sky, or we are out of the sky? We're inside the sky. Okay, so the how he says, how he say he split us. Are we split? If we are inside something, how we can be split? Imagine I put you inside the room, and I say to you, you are split from the room, but you are inside the room. Okay, you know, do you know what atoms are? I know what atom is. Do you know Mr. Atom okay. yourself? Uh, let, me explain, well, let me explain something to you. Very Hold on. You is, have a atom, is atom in or out? Have, okay, look. Can I explain something? You have is atom is atom is no, inside or outside? You can, I'm answering every single one of your questions, okay? <laughs> just answer, please. Just let me speak. You okay? never I'll answer anything. Let me remind you. As just a minute ago, you said to me, I don't know what to say about this one, and we move to the second topic. So since when <laughs> you are answering, you never answer anything. Now, giving me room now to listen, listen, questions. listen. What about we read the interpretation for this verse? Is that okay for you? No. Why no? Please, can I please have my turn to speak? I'm asking you, why you don't want to read the Islamic interpretation? Is, is the Islamic interpretation for the verse is embarrassing for you? No, it is not. So, I'm explaining so it. So why okay. you don't want to read the interpretation for this verse? What's what the problem? Speak again for you, okay? Do not, do not the disbelievers. I'm see asking that you. The I'm asking you. Why you together. are trying to fabricate interpretation? It never exists. If we read the Islamic interpretation, do they agree with you, or this is your fabrication, Muslims, in 2019? 2019. Well, is that a new fabrication of the Quran, or this is how the Quran understood by Muslims? <laughs> Okay, 
we 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 and we um I, I don't understand where you where you're coming from. <laughs> I'm asking you now. Is this yeah. is understanding the one you are yeah. giving me now, and you're trying to explain to me why it's yes. so complicated? Why you don't tell me? Okay, you know what? We have earth, we are heaven. What we have now? There used to be one. There used to be one, right? But there was okay. earth, there was earth, and there was heaven. Does the Quran says that? There was earth. There was earth, and there, and there was, was heaven. heaven. Okay, is the Big Bang believe that there was earth and there was heaven, and then they boom? Yes. The, the Big Bang believe in that. <laughs> the Big Bang believe the earth and the heaven they use exist together. I'm trying to. Um. Hmm. Um, who's reading for me? Hmm. Okay, what is your question again? Sorry, and you are asking me that what the question what's wrong with you? Are you lost? Here it says that there's earth and there is heaven, and they used to be one unit, so there is earth yeah. and there is heaven. It is not after that they are created. So is that what the Big Bang teach that there was earth and they were heaven, but they used to be stitched together? Is that what the Big Bang teach? Yes. That's a lie. The Big Bang says that there is an explosion, and then after millions of years, trillions of years, the earth was created. Why are you are lying? Why did you say explosion? What's what so what the Big Bang is? What bang mean? I thought you speak better English than mine. What bang mean? Big bang. What what does that mean? Okay, not uh, what 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 what, not, the, what, the bang, what the world bang what the world bang mean? What the big bang? What the big bang mean? What the world bang mean? Teach me. I want to learn English from you. Okay, it may not be big bang or whatever, but it's just the term that we use to ex to describe the expansion of the universe. Mm. But in the Quran, it just it describes it. Mm. Not as an explosion. <laughs> okay, Abdul. First of all, let me show that everybody how Muslims are stupid and silly. And the second you corner, then they start speaking things which have nothing to do with our topic. Listen, does it say here, don't the be disbelievers see? Does it say see? Okay. Okay. Do they see that really? Do those believers in the time of Muhammad saw the Big Bang? Does it say the people of Muhammad? It says the unbelievers, so it means people. Yeah, throughout nobody the saw the Big Bang. Nobody saw the Big Bang. It says, "Don't, don't the unbelievers see?" Does it say the word "see"? Yes. Okay, he is talking about something they see. Okay. Okay, and what he's saying that the earth and the heaven used to be together. Did it, did did anyone see that? You if I say to you, if I say to you, didn't you see, didn't you see the flood of Noah? You would say to me, no, I did not see. I heard of it. So the statement here is a stupid. It says were that they were. He didn't say what where, what where, what where, what where. Yeah, where it says, didn't they see what is where they saw it? Didn't they see the believers? Didn't they see? Okay. Did they see any of this? Okay, hold on. What they see? What they see, they see what they see that the earth and the heaven are not together no more. At least, do you agree? Can I can I tell you something? Okay, <laughs> when we see something expanding, mm. like if, for example, if we see an ex a, a, a balloon expanding, uh. we can see that the uh, that the balloon started off small because it's expanding. Mm. So, from our logic, we can see that mm. it was the balloon mm. was started off small. Mm. So sorry, when it was small, we can see that it was small. Uh, but did we see any of this, Abdul? Did we see we are talking about a specific thing? And you are the one who said this is the Big Bang. So did those people see any of the Big Bang? When the balloon was expanding, did you see what okay? If you if you used to see somebody did in you the see the heaven expanding yourself? 
I'm trying to I'm trying to explain this in the no, most No, you cannot explain. Term, no, no, you are not explaining. Understand. You are just going in a circle. Did they see that? First of all, so they did not see this is a lie. Not, it's a stupid uh, this is a stupid statement. Secondly, the earth and the, and the sky, they were not at one unit together and we split them because simply they are together still. We are inside the space. We are not out of the space. If we are out of the sky, that will make us split it. But we are right now we're swimming in the space. We are like a big spaceship. So how you can say, imagine you have a spaceship in the sky and you say we split the spaceship from the sky. It's a it's a flying in the sky. How you say that? Are you serious about this? Like I'm very serious. I'm very serious. I want you to answer me. If a spaceship, if a spaceship is in the sky, is it inside the sky or it is a split it from the sky? Answer. I don't understand how that I, I, what do you mean you don't understand? The earth is the same. The earth is a small tiny little dust inside the space. So how we are split it from the space. What do you mean split it from the space? This is what it says. It says they used to be one unit and we separate them. Why are you talking about spaceships and split it from the sky? The Earth is the same as a spaceship. It's a huge, for us it's a huge, but in the space it's so small. It's not even the size of a dust compared to the space. Not even the size of a dust. So how we can say that the Earth is separated from the heaven if we are swimming inside the heaven? When does it say that they were split apart? In the front of you, aren't you the one who said to me this? It that this is the big. <laughs> My friend, it says, together, read like carefully, like read carefully. This is the translation in front of you. It says, before we clove them asunder. What the word the clove mean? Bring apart. Okay, so separated. They became apart. Are we apart from the space? Hmm? What do you need to get? What do you need to get? Sorry, one moment. Sorry. Hmm. Just, I'm, I'm talking to someone. Sorry. No problem. So, what do you think? <clears throat> Are we clove them asunder? Did that what happen? Okay. Um. The word clove asunder means mm -hmm. when something gets taken apart, it doesn't mean like. Mm. Are we apart? Like, Are we apart niche? from the space? Are we apart from the space? It depends on how you how you, how you saying it. No, no, no. There's no depend. Are we apart of this from the space? Are we inside the space or we are not? We're inside of empty space, yes. Okay, so how we are apart from the space? We're not part of the space, but we're inside the space. Okay, so you just said that the Quran is saying he made us apart. Oh. We are apart from the sky. This is what you said just a second ago. So how we are apart if we are inside? When we're... Uh, no, I'm, I don't mean a part like a part like we're part of it. Like I'm a part of that group. <laughs> I'm a part of. Okay, um, I, I, this I, 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 I listen, 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 like, Abdul. Listen, I'm I don't know what's your name. What's, what's your name? What's your name? Abdullah. Abdullah. Listen, Abdullah. I was right when I said Abdul. Listen, this is Tafsir al Jalalain. Is that okay to read it for you? Say that again. This is Tafsir al Jalalain. Is that okay to read it for you, or you wouldn't like a Muslim scholar to explain? So I don't I don't understand what, you, what you're saying. Say that again. Read carefully. This is Tafsir Jalalain. It says, "Have they not? One may read, etc. He read in Arabic here. Realized? Have they not come to know those who disbelieve that the heaven and the earth were closed together, and then we parted them. We made seven heavens and seven earth." Is that a true? There is seven earth. Seven earth. Mm. Okay, have they not one main and one? They have not come to those who believe that the heavens and earth were close together, and then we parted them and made seven heavens and seven. 
Okay, what was your question about this again? I'm asking you now. Is that another stupid mistake that there is seven Earth? No. So there is seven Earth. Yes. Where are they? It means dimensions. Do you know what dimensions are? Dimension. What dimension? Like this. Um. There's a first dimension, second dimension, third okay, what dimension. Is this, what is the first? Dim what is the first Earth and the second Earth? And, and I'm trying to understand. What is the first Earth? The second Earth. Do you know what a dimension is? My friend, you tell me what is a seven earth? What does that mean? It means did your God he said seven dimension or he said seven earth and seven heavens? That's from seven different dimensions. Do you know what that means? I'm asking you, did your God Allah say there are seven skies? Is the seven skies are seven dimensions too? Or they are literally seven do skies. You know what dimensions are? are they seven skies literally or not? Or it's one yes, sky literally okay literally so he's saying there yeah. are seven skies and seven earth so you cannot say this is a dimension and that one is not dimension so it is literally what is the seven earth oh. literally I cannot ask you about the seven heaven because nobody saws what is there what is the seven earth how long have you been I'm um, like reading English like studying English like how long I am not reading English I'm reading in Arabic Stop no, being a, stop being a stop being a stop being a fool. I am here schooling you in your own Quran language, and not the English is for the fool like you who don't speak. He pray to Allah in Arabic, but yet you don't know Arabic because you're a fool. No, my sisters in here. Now, I, I'm asking you. I'm asking you. I'm asking you. What is the seven earth in the Quran? I'm happy this is going live, you know, because. You're making a fool of yourself. You don't even know what dimension is. You tell me, okay, seven earth, what the seven dimension is. Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> okay, let me go to Google and ask what a dimension is. I thought you know, but now you are searching. I'm going, I'm getting the actual definition, so I don't make any, I'm not, I don't know the, I don't know. <laughs> so you are using a word, you yourself, you do not know, and you are telling me, do you know what seven dimension means? Okay. Hmm. I don't, I don't know the exact it's definition for a dimension. So why you are saying so to me, why you keep saying to me for the last five well, minutes, making fun of my English, saying, do you know you what seven dimension means? And now you yourself, you do not know what seven dimensions mean. Do you know what a realm is? I'm asking you, why you mention to me seven dimensions if you do not know what they mean? Okay, I don't know every single word. But you are I the one who said to me, don't, don't you know? I don't know the exact you are the one. You are the one who said to me. Host, listen. You are the one who said to me, don't you know? Listen, listen. You are the one. You are the one who said. Hold on. You are the one who said. Listen. 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 You are the one who said. Don't you know? As if you know. And now, when you made fun of my English, and now we discover that you yourself you do not know what the word you said to me means. Isn't it, this I know is funny. It means, but I don't know the literal definition. That's mean you do not know still because you just say because I know it means. because you are you know how to say the words, but they do not know what they mean. Okay, explain to me what the seven dimensions mean. I'm listening. Okay, do you know what a realm is? You know what? A realm. A realm. What is that? Um, R E A L M. Okay, go ahead. What is that? This is shocking. I can't believe it. <laughs> Abdul, it, 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 okay. let, let me show everybody. Let, let me show everybody me. that you, you, are, a, you, you are you are being smoked and the smoke is coming from your head. Can you show me okay. one Islamic interpretation? Speak about okay. the dimension of those of, of, of uh, the seven earth. Where do you get this from? The okay. dimension is that from okay, your head? I, listen, listen, can you? everybody will laugh at you in a second. Is that a creation of your own? Is that your okay, own fabrication, or this is what the Islamic scholars agreed upon? I'm asking you, is that what the Muslims agree upon? That this is seven dimension, or the Muslims believe that there are seven real earth? Both. What both? So to cover you to, to cover yourself, you say both. What do you mean both? Okay, show me the scholar who believe in both. As long okay, okay, I will go with you. Who is the scholar? He agreed that it is both. It is seven earth and seven dimension. I don't care. That's it. You agreed that it is seven earth. Where are they? As long you said both, as long you agreed that they are both. Okay, so we have seven earth. 
what is the seven earth Allah he created where are they I'm asking you what are they what are Hmm. What are the dimensions? No, what are the seven earth? Because you said both. Now you cannot get away from it. You said both. I asked you, is it literally seven earth and seven dimension or seven earth and uh, which one? You said both. So now you cannot say they are not seven earth no more. So where we come, where are they? What are they, those seven earth? Earths. Hmm. They, are, they are earths. The earths are earths. The earth is earth. Okay. What is the second one? What do you mean second one? The second earth. There are seven. The sec are you asking me for like the locations? Like what are the they? What are they? When Allah He says, I created you, and He said, Don't you see? Don't you see? It's mean we see them. Where are they? Come to know those who believe that the heavens and earth were close together and then we part them we made seven hearts. Is in where does it say that we, we see them? The what the verse before it there it says don't you don't the disbelievers they see you this forgot? is not a verse this is a hadith oh this is not quran the quran never say the quran the earth is seven earth no this is oh my god so this is hadith this... so so if it's hadith now you don't accept it are you saying that to me i, I didn't say that I said, okay so you, okay you, so you, it, you, you so this, this is so this is not quran. Quran. so not this is not quran. quran this is a stupid guy saying there's seven earth I didn't say that. Either. Okay, so who is the stupid guy saying that there's seven earth? Who is I he? I didn't say he's stupid either. Okay, who is the one who said that? Why are you saying? Why are you saying stupid guy? Stupid, okay, the smart stupid guy. Stupid. Okay, who is the smart guy who said there is seven earth? Do do I call you stupid? Do I call My Jesus friend, stupid? I, I, okay, I, I, I just say no, Jesus. You are saying to me. You are saying to me. Is that is that Muhammad? Are you? Are What's wrong with you? Are you saying Muhammad saying that? Are you? Are you a person of knowledge? I, I'm learning from you. As you see, I do not know what the seven You're dimensions mean. It's, it's you as the person of knowledge. I'm asking you, who is the one who saying there is seven earth? If he had brains... Listen, if, listen, if not, listen. You are a potato. You have no idea what are you talking about. Who is the one who said there is seven earth? Head. Who I is the one who is, stupid, the, who, who is the one who said there is seven earth? I'm asking you, please answer. Who is the one who said that? The, you can see the person tafsir al jal okay. I don't know. So you are saying name. this is a yeah. Jalalain, not your God Allah. Yes, it's a tafsir. A tafsir is an explanation of uh, I verse. thought I thought Allah saying that. So this is a tafsir, not Allah. Yes, this is a tafsir. Okay, a so tafsir. maybe this guy maybe he's wrong it's, then. Maybe he's wrong because he's a scholar. He's a scholar, maybe he's wrong. How you take his words for granted that there are seven? How you take oh, a man? How you take a man saying to you there is seven what, earth for what, granted? Maybe he's wrong. Yes, maybe he is wrong. You are right. Okay, you are right. So you are right. But look, look, guess what? In a second, you will change your mind because this is Quran. It is the Quran saying that. And now, what you will say? You will say I, you I, you I, you I, will I, you will stay I, honest I, and you will say this is wrong. Still, maybe here we go. It is the Quran says there is seven earth and seven heaven. Okay. But you just said maybe he's wrong and you agreed. No, I said he could be wrong because per everybody people perfect, make perfect, but perfect. So he could be wrong. He could be wrong. Okay, now why why the one who said this cannot be wrong no more? He's saying I said he could be wrong, but I'm not disagreeing with what he's saying. Buddy, take a hike. Let your dad call me next time, okay? I want an adult to talk to me. <laughs> Unbelievable. He created the earth and the heaven, seven earth and seven heaven. A second ago, he said it could be wrong. Okay, now he is talking. Is he wrong anymore? No. You see how they change? Just because I showed him, I just made him believe that, okay, maybe this is uh, the, 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 the guy they're talking there. Uh, he want to save his ass. So right away he said, okay, maybe he's wrong. Yeah, you are right. Maybe he's wrong. Huh? Because he could not answer. So it was like, a, like somebody in the ocean and he found a piece of wood and he want to hold in it. And then when he found that the piece of wood he hold is not a wood, it's a shark.
You see, those Muslims, you cannot debate them. You have to trap them for very simple reason. 90% of them, they are playing dishonest. You show them the Quran saying, Allah, he placed the mountains in the top of the earth. And he says to me, do you know what place on me? Do you know what uh, dimension mean? Do you know? And, and he make fun of my English. <laughs> Don't they are not honest people. They will play all kind of games in order to deceive and not to answer. Everything you showed us, we prove it to be false and we got your prophet busted with no mercy. And here, when you showed me this, approving to me, very stupid statement. And by the way, this guy, he said that Allah, he created from everything, from water, everything created from water. Well, the angels are not created from water, neither the genie. And this is a very clear mistake. Is the angel created from water? No. Is the genie created from water? The, the, the angels are created from light and the genie created from fire. What this God is talking about. Stupidity. And you know, seven earth or seven dimension, who cares? Everything is dimension. Everything we have us around us, as long as it's physical, is dimension. Actually, even the empty space is a dimension. What, what, what a stupid answer. Seven dimension. So what if it's seven dimension? Seven dimension. So? But they cannot explain. And not only that, do you know that Allah, He created the stars so He can shoot the shaitan in His ass? This is the purpose of the stars, as a beautification for the beholder, for us. But as you know, we don't see all the stars. Actually, we don't even see one of billion percent of the stars. And indeed, we have adorned the nearest heaven with lamps, and we have made such a lamps as missiles to drive away the shaitan. Allah Akbar, Allahu Akbar, Star War, Stargate. Shaitan, Allah will shoot him by a star. But isn't it the shaitan he sleep in your nose? As Muhammad he said, How shaitan he sleep in your nose, yet to kill him, you need a star. A star. I mean, don't you think this is too big? And how you can shoot the star who cannot leave the earth by, I mean, you shoot, shoot a shaitan who live in the earth by a star, but this guy is inside the earth. This is science. And the seven skies are seven in the top of each other. All right. We aren't going to stay longer because this is getting too long. And uh, so give you opportunity to download. Guys, you can download the whole thing. Please download it. We will not keep it for long in the in my page. So, uh, and I hope that this guy, he will see how silly the Quran is. And as you see, the Muslims, they have no knowledge whatsoever in, on anything. Poor people, they lie to them about miracle in the Quran. The word brother, the word women in the Quran is repeated. The word brother, we check on, never true. Miracle of number 19, go watch my videos about it. It's a big fat lie. By the way, even Muslims, they reject this false miracle. Even the guy who came with it, they killed him. His name is Rashad Khalifa. 
he have to take verses from the Quran to make it fit and even after he took the verses still it doesn't fit because it's stupid <clears throat> my friend I am a Christian Prince and neither your God or his angels or his prophet can debate me I was speaking to you going down to your level next time call your scholar say can you call this guy we want a scholar to dare to call where are they where are they they are missing we cannot find them in the radar after I hang up and I go the scholars will be there and then everybody will be a scholar in a magical way uh, Georgie maybe next time my friend that's that set I am here for three hours already so I want to say guys thank you for being here and uh, I hope to see you tomorrow if I can don't forget to subscribe you can read my books if you like and we have in Spanish German Dutch French uh, English uh, so you can search for my books in amazon.com Amazon Spain Amazon uh, England whatever it is and you will find them if you like to read and learn more about the stupid cult of Islam and I will see you again may the Lord bless you Christ is Lord and Islam is false thank you very much take care